Uh, the Toledo Rockets are preparing for the Barstool Sports Arizona Bowl tomorrow. A lot of fans will be cheering on Toledo as they battle Wyoming, including one young Rocket fan who's fighting a totally different battle. Our Tyler Segerman has the story. When the Toledo Rockets kick off their bowl game tomorrow, one special young fan will be in the stands cheering them on. An experience that has played out into the impact of a lifetime. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. Yeah, touchdown again. Another touchdown dance. You got another touchdown dance? Oh, the waddle. <laughs> he's doing really well. Um, he's happy, joyful, sports-loving kid. The fascination for football has never left this five-year-old. <laughs> Whether playing, watching, or even writing about the game, Charlie Myers enjoys some pigskin. <gasps> However, last year, that love had to be put on pause. To say that you can, you're prepared for anything like that would be an understatement. Um, it, it was a shock, it just uh, throws your world upside down. Leukemia entered Charlie's life, forcing he and his family to spend more time in a Toledo hospital than the gridiron. An organization called Team Impact stepped in, and with help from UT football, his passion returned. It, it's something special. Every time they see him on the sideline, every time they see him um, um, at practice, like it's a fist bump, how's he doing, and it's a, it uplifts the spirit. Toledo's Tim Bennett has led the charge for Charlie to interact with the team throughout this season. It's, it's cool because they kind of even text me, text me today, hey, can we carve out an hour and we can spend with, with Charlie. A family with no ties to this program, now one of the biggest supporters. We've been huge fans ever since. We've, we've followed the team. We watch pretty much every single game on TV that we haven't been able to go to. Charlie has meant a lot to Toledo football. Same can be said for the Rockets, whose inspiring presence during a difficult time has uplifted this Monroe, Michigan family. We've been at the hospital and we've talked about, you know, just, hey, let's get through this. You know, those, those Toledo guys are counting on you. And that's been a, a huge motivator for them. <laughs> and more great news to share about Charlie. He's now what's in the maintenance stage of treatment, which means he only goes to the doctor once a month. And the best part, he will be done with all of it next year. In Tucson, Tyler Segerman, WTOL 11.